So this is going to be interesting. This is unlike anything I've ever played before. I've never played a roguelike game, and I can't say that I've ever really had a burning desire to, but who knows? I might end up falling in love. So what's up, guys, and welcome to Returnal Part 1, The Beginning. It's a brand new game just dropped today. It's on PS5 only. PS5 exclusive, developed only for the next-gen console, so kind of exciting in that regard, and uh, it's got a very interesting synopsis idea plot you've got this chick here celine she's stuck in a time loop on an alien planet and every time you die and then you know come back it's it's going to be a different experience so uh very unique in that regard it's got some great reviews that are coming out this morning and um like i said it's not something that was like specifically my cup of tea from what i can tell but i'm down to try it out i'm always down to expand my horizons and uh, if it ends up being a lot of fun you guys want to see more we could turn this into a whole series so hope you guys are excited for it if you are be sure to drop a like and uh, here we go returnal is intended to be a challenging experience each new cycle presents new challenges rewards and changes to the world adapt and persevere to progress further when you die or close Returnal, you will always be returned to the crash site and all non-permanent progression will be lost. You can suspend your cycle by using the console's rest mode functionality. That sounds pretty intense, okay. Here we go. Celine. So she's approaching an alien planet she's not supposed to be going to. Big storm down there. Girl, you crazy. Why would you be doing this? I didn't see this coming. Dude, the vibrations on the dual sense are undefeated. This thing is going wild right now. I guess this is technically the first game that's like really focused on that too. I can feel the raindrops. Astro, this is Celine. I've crashed on Atropos. I survived, but... Helios did not. Suit status operational, but my sidearm is missing. I'm leaving comms open. Dude, this is beautiful. And I can feel the pitter-patter of the raindrops in my controller. Enough about the rain, though. Let's get after it. So we want to locate the white shadow broadcast. Helios. Heading towards White Shadow Broadcast. 
Okay, so she's got some movement. Oh my gosh, those doors are quick. This Keep thinking we're gonna... This extensive ruins of a Xenotype civilization. One and two. Ancient walls, foundations, and statues. What is this world, man? Scoutlog, Atropos. I have found a deceased Astro Scout here. Checking identification on a helmet. It's... Me? I had a gun. Okay. Continuing towards the signal's origin. Imagine running up on your own dead body. Okay, so we can now aim, fire, and then, you know, hip fire. Is this over here? Okay. When in doubt, shoot it. Is this here? Undiscovered item. Let's scan it. Discovered a potential resource. Positive analysis for suit repairs. Classifying as Sylphium. Interesting. So we're going to be able to just name resources all around the map, whatever we want. What is this over here? It kind of... It's kind of in the form of a human, is it not? Are those glowing? Uh, I don't know, dude. Okay. Let's, let's keep going. Ooh. Scare me a little bit. Looks like that's going to be locked. A Xenotech gate secure with a lock mechanism. It requires a key. We got one direction to go in that case. Okay, I'm a little bit nervous. I think they see us. Let's go, Trev. Gotta jump over that. Picking bad times to reload, Celine. There it is. Hostile fauna dispatched. Alright, we've got something over here. Scout log. Might as well take Recorded that. log found. Adding to data bank. Playing back now. Hmm. Scout log. Atropos. Elapsed time 30 minutes since last crash. Whole areas of this forest are rearranging themselves like a fluid puzzle after each of my. When. Whenever I return, per Astro Protocol. I will not be recovered until I reach the broadcast signal. If you're hearing this, you are stuck here too. So alternate universe me kind of has this a little bit figured out, I guess. I We're trying to leave hints that. for ourselves. Is this going to be our key? This might be the key we needed. The tropian key. Yeah, we'll take that. All right. Interesting. So we got to keep replaying through leaving notes for ourselves. Let's go ahead and pick all this up as well. To be able to try to figure out a way off this planet. Dude, this would be... I'm already kind of mind effed a little bit. I want to see our data bank here. See what we've got going on with these resources. So we've got the Silphium, of course. We've got this Obelite. Looks like this is going to be used to power dormant Xenotype machinery. And then we've also... Of course, we've got the key. Scout logs. All right. We also saw Adrenaline for the first time there. So it's raised every three hostiles you eliminate up to five times. Upon taking damage, it's reset. Each level provides... A unique effect which stacks with the others. Okay, cool. Sounds good to me. So we're going to head back this way. We're going to be able to use this key. And we should be able to go on through this door. Hmm. Circle press to dash. Hold it for a longer dash. Use it while in midair to perform long jumps. Beautiful. We'll take that. What is this here? 
Silphium resin. Don't mind if I do. Got some sort of a blocked doorway there. Guess we're gonna have to go over this way. Take that. Don't look down, Trev. Whoa, okay. We're good. I think there are others out here. I hear lots of bad stuff. Got him. Okay. So we can really use the movement here. I know there's a lot of verticality. It's, it's kind of meant to be like almost an arena style. You know, quickly get up in people's faces. Adrenaline level two, we'll take it. So we're gonna get enhanced vision. Obviously right now we don't really have much to work with besides this pistol, but eventually we're gonna have all kinds of abilities and weapons and stuff like that. What is this? Every time there's something new. Malignant key. I mean, I'll definitely pick that up. This stuff as well. Looks like that might be able to be broken eventually. I don't know how that works though. Malignant items or effects came from malignant parasites. Remove malfunction by completing the attacks on the left side of the screen. Let's just keep going. <laughs> I'm so lost. I've discovered piled corpses of a xenotype species. Likely the architects of these ruins. These could be the sentience that broadcast the white shadow signal. Got a scout log here. It is impossible to escape. I have tried everything. I'm always brought back by... There is a moment between death and rebirth when tentacles drag me down, screaming, drowning, returning. Returnal. Bro, this is terrifying. I can't imagine being stuck in something like this. Just an endless loop of death and discouragement. I don't think we want to go that way. It looks like we're going to... Just keep on pressing forward. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Calm down! What? Oh my god! What is this? Just keep dodging, Celine. Where's our health? Bottom left. Okay, he got us there a little bit. Get out of there. Reload and dodge. Woo! Get out of there! Let's go, Celine. Reload. He's almost done. He's dead. Highly aggressive. Oh, barely dispatched. What was that? Got ourselves a broken calibrator. Grants a small amount of weapon proficiency. All right, we'll pick that up for sure. I mean, we had to work for that thing. My goodness, that was terrifying. Which way do we want to go? That way? Or this way? He came from over here. Hmm. Okay. Just gonna keep on pushing. Got another unknown object over here. A tropian weapon charger. New technology discovered. Augments my weapon with an alternative firing mechanism. Oh. So halfway is to aim and shoot like normal. Full. Highly effective. We'll shoot that. This will be useful. Okay. Sorry about your luck there, Mr. Alien. How do I shoot? I was trying to do do the charge thing, but it wasn't working. There it is. Adrenaline one. Okay. Kind of a little bit confused as to how that works, but we're, we're gonna figure it out, don't you worry. So if we hold it down, you have to let it charge? Ah, you just gotta let it charge, there it is. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. These guys are fairly easy to, uh, to dodge, that's for sure. 
Beast down, we're level two. Definitely want to keep that up. Get that guy from a distance. Looks like we've got some stuff up top that we might want to get. How do we get up top, though? Well, there's so much going on here. Might be able to jump from this side. Like what? What is this? Can I break this? Of course I can. Now what's behind the big scary wall that we broke? Ooh, something pretty fancy. We've also got this guy. Shield disruptor, data cube, deposit, and matchmaking or matching device to permanently unlock this item designed for future cycles. You can carry one at a time. So do we, I mean, do we have to like activate that so we're going to be able to use it in the future cycle or? Dude, I've, I've got some research I need to do, man. This is, this is not easy. So like if we, if we upgrade our pistol and then we die, the future us can come back and pick that pistol up. Like that, that sort of thing. Shoot. Let me get up here. I want to use our dash. There it is. Pick that up. Just checking. Just checking. All right. What is this guy over here? Okay. Stepped in some muck. That's fine. Here we go. Let's keep on going. Why do I feel like I'm about to... Oh, God. What is this? An AR. But I'm about to meet a, a basilisk a down here or something. A xenotype weapon, similar to our carbine technology. Okay. That's it? There's no, like, trickery? There's no, oh, ha, ha you took our gun, we're gonna come kill you? What do we have out here? Discover a massive wall beyond which is the white shadow signal. I can't cross the chasm. For now, I'll change objectives and investigate the energy reading in the forest. Okay, so I guess we are going to be able to go to the broadcast. We're going to have to go to the forest first. Here's another scout log. Scout log, Atropos. Who triggered the broadcast? Do you see the white shadow is something only I should know? And now, out of literally nowhere, I'm hearing it again. Were the sentients involved? But how would they have known? I need to believe there are answers at the signal. Inert device, a Xenotech device. It requires something to activate it. We're gonna get, need to get Xenotech to be able to get that. We've got more glowing heads here. Hmm. How'd I know we were gonna have something going on? There it is, they're down. Up to adrenaline level three. That's the highest we've been thus far. I hear all kinds of stuff off in the distance here. Do this. Oh! What is that? I'm gonna try to take down some of the. Oh, shoot, missed him. We're good. Don't take any damage, Trev. If you don't take any damage, you're gonna be able to keep your adrenaline up. This thing has kind of a low overheat. Take him down, beautiful work. Got another one here. He's down. Weapon proficiency is leveling up. Let's go over and collect all of this stuff here. Yeah, we're high adrenaline right now. We've got all five of our boosts. This game is... I've heard it makes Dark Souls look easy, so I think keeping our, our boosts and stuff up is going to be very important. Get every advantage we can. Here we go. Unknown device. 
An inert reclaimer. To be used to recover and increase integrity. Take a nice little nap. I don't know who that spaceman was, but that was a little bit creepy. Dude, I'm so lost. I, I, I tried to go through and... You know, read all the tutorials and... Um, little descriptions and stuff like that, and I'm, I'm still lost as to what's fully going on here. I think we go this way? Another scout now. I have interacted with you died a lot, huh? Of myself. But I worry one day I will re-experience these same interactions from their perspectives but are they truly me or just hollowed corpses this may be the face of things to come we need xenotech to be able to activate that whatever that is hmm. keep on going somehow i knew y'all would be here he's down Another one back there, he's down. Beautiful. Ooh. Nicely done. Got some more up here somewhere. Woo. And I'm kind of playing it pretty safe here. Did I get him? A little bit, not really. Obviously, we could move around and be a little bit more aggressive, but I, I kind of want to try to keep all of our abilities. Ooh. See, if we get up close and personal like this, it gets a little sketch. He's down. I love that we can see people through the walls. We got aimbots, baby. He's gone. Woo! There it is. Okay. I think that's everyone. Not too shabby. This big ol' obelite chunk, we're gonna need some Xenotech to be able to, I guess, you know, harvest it. The little ones we can, though. Hmm. Not sure what's going on with that. Malignant Silphium. Don't mind if I do. Now, malignant items, they're like cursed and they can they can give us, you know, bad, uh, bad stuff. Ether, pick that up. They can give us malfunctions in our suit that can eventually, you know, kind of harm us. And to be honest, I don't know. I just know it's, you got to be careful around that kind of stuff. Fortified energy barrier, resistance, normal melee damage. More Xenotech is required. I don't know that we were going the right way. If we take a look at our map, oh, we want to go up to the right. Up here, maybe? Ah, we were going the wrong way. Okay. Seems like an area where we get ganged up on! Well, I knew it was coming at least. Still scared me. Got another one of these little portals. Is this gonna be like a teleportation device or something? I don't know. What world is this? Do I even want to know what that is? It's discovered xenotype technology on the corpse of a sentient. The scan is indicating potential for suit augmentation. I don't think he's gonna appreciate that. Whatever the heck he is. Appears safe to repurpose. <sighs> System integration complete. Performing a function test to confirm. What? Your suit can now use translocators to teleport, so I'm thinking it's those things. Let's see if there's anything else back here, and then we'll go back to that. Interesting. Is there anything up top by chance? No. 
these are the type of games where it really kind of pays to uh, go the extra mile and make sure you're searching around. So you're going to be able to activate this short distance travel. Look at that. Could confirmed. Point to point teleportation. Location exit seems fixed. So wait, now that we have this, we're gonna be able to go back the way we came from. Wasn't there a uh, yeah up over here? There's somebody out here. No. We should be able to use this. We walked by this earlier. I don't know where we're going, or what our goal is, but we're in route. Flying octopus things are down, okay. We just go ahead and collect all this stuff, and we're just gonna be able to use these teleporters to go every which direction. We found ether. Don't mind if I do. So over in the, the top left, we've got a malfunction. That's from picking up one of the like cursed artifacts or whatever. It says collect diamond artifacts. We need to collect one of those, and that's gonna get the malfunction to go away. If you get three suit malfunctions at once. I think it deletes something from your inventory, and maybe you die, I'm not sure. Who knows? Let's just keep pushing forward and hope it all starts to make sense at some point. So we're back here now. We can definitely go that way. Reveal exits to an area, for sure, I can see it. Nothing creepy about this room. Discovered Xenotype technology that produces other devices. Increases max in tech. I mean, we already have. So these are all the, the resources we've been collecting throughout the game so far. So that's going to increase our integrity. And then we can do something with this. Obelite repository device that exchanges ether and obelites for one another. Seems poised to do something if enough obelites are placed in it. Go online. Okay. We don't have ether or obelites to be able to do it. Fabricator. So we, I believe, if we take a look at our equipment, we got... I, I want to figure out how to use this data cube. So you can only carry one of these at a time and it's, it's used to, you know, unlock something. Is that, is that what we're going to do here? No. This is to purchase things. This is like a little store. We don't have enough obelites. I don't know how to get our cube thing to work. Obviously, that's going to be kind of important. This does not look good. Xenoglyph writings by the sentience. Xenotype language discovered. Currently lacking resources to decipher this xenoglyph. So we need to learn their language. This isn't a door, is it? No. We've got something glowing over here. Might as well stand on it. Xenotech device for long distance traveling. I don't think... So that's fast traveling. What do we have here? More writing. Might be able to help us start to kind of understand it a bit. Discovered a fragment of the xenotype language. So we're gonna wanna We're gonna wanna uncover lots of those to be able to figure out what in the world is going on in this crazy earth. Dude, this game is is insane so far. I I, I don't even know. I I, I just don't know. Strange energy reading. Setting a marker on my map. Let's take a look at the map. Yep, energy readings off to the left here. We're gonna have some sort of a big boss fight or something guaranteed. Alright, well. Get out of here, fam! He gone. There it is. All right, I'm gonna wait. Try to wait for our extra ability to start to repopulate. What the fudge is that? Hold on a second. I'm gonna need my my grenade back. There it is. He's down. So we just took a little bit of damage there. I didn't notice that we, uh, I'm gonna go collect all this stuff. I didn't notice that we picked that up. Suit in integrity increased. I didn't notice that we lost any of our abilities though. I thought you lost your abilities upon 
taking damage. So it looks like we want to go through here. There was another door back here, though. And there's stuff up top up there. I just kind of want to see where this goes. Yeah, I don't think... Let's, let's keep going towards our objective, Trev. Gonna keep going this way. I mean, the, the, the map, the vibe, the, the location is cool. This is, oh, this is some sort of a ooh, boss battle, maybe? Boss arena? Let's see what this is. So we've got our tachyomatic carbine, which is our, our rifle we had. We can swap it for a spit mob blaster. What is that? I mean, I'll just spam him all day long. Lockdown has been lifted. Do I want this thing? Which one do I want? I'm, I, to be honest, I kind of liked our carbine, but I'm, I'm thinking maybe we want to stick with this. Which direction do we want to go, girl? We want to keep going going left excuse me is this a, a transistor transponder you can fast travel translocator yeah what is going on oh yep there we just lost our adrenaline Definitely not as, as good as good from range here. Shoot. He's down. I feel like it does a good job otherwise though. Like, you know, up close obviously it's very good. How come we can't carry two two weapons at a time? Dude, this thing fries. Absolutely fries. Just double tapping everyone. That was a single tap right there. He's down. Adrenaline's been advanced again there. Okay, hopefully we can keep it alive this time. I kind of got a bit of a deer in the headlights there. So we got a, uh, a, a four-star tachyo chromatic whatever now. So we're, we're upgrading our weapons somehow, but I can't carry more than one. I, dude, I don't really know how it works. So I'm just I'm just gonna keep on pushing. Really? It's like we've got a one's way, one way translator. Oh, it's just gonna take us right back up top. We'll take it, okay. I thought we were gonna be stuck down there or something or have some sort of a fight because we got ag aggressive and went and tried to pick that stuff up. Come on now. He's down. Got one over here. These guys are pretty smart, dude. They, uh... You know. They don't just sit there and tank damage. They try to get out of the way. That's some sort of a new... Oh! I thought I heard somebody behind me. They're dead. Well. Lost my adrenaline, but that's fine. I don't, I don't think it's that big of a deal. I think we're over... Emphasizing the adrenaline. I also feel like if we run around and instead of, like, you know, aiming at everyone, I think if we just run around and spam, that might be a little bit better, too. We need some more Xenotech to be able to get that stuff. I did see something down here. It looks like we've got, uh... Some sort of a little puzzle. We're going to be able to pick up some Silphium and stuff. Unless well, just a shadow. Security system encountered. What's that down there? Shoot! So this is another one of those... Fabricator costs increased by 25%. We need to use consumables to be able to stop that. I, uh, if I go to my equipment... We don't have any consumables. Shoot. Okay, we shouldn't have picked that up. That was another one of those cursed objects. So now I think 
If we pick up one more of those, we're gonna have something randomly deleted from our inventory. I don't I'm not sure. What in the fudge? That's, that can't be here. That's my house. The astronaut, that's the one when she took a rest. She saw him in her dreams. I gotta keep it real, dude. I'm I'm lost. I am lost in the sauce here. I have, I have no idea what's going on. We're just gonna keep on going. Oh, see some big boys over here in the corner. All right. Well, don't get hit, Trev. That's never a good idea. I finished that guy off. Um, yeah, I missed our reload right there. I think if you hit the, the R2 at the right time, your gun will... Regen faster, it won't take as long for the overheat. One thing I think we need to do to more of is the movement is so good in this game. I think we just need to, to stick and move a lot better. We've been kind of staying put and firing from a distance, which is great in a situation like that one right there, but I feel like a lot of the time it might be a better idea just to run around and kind of spray people. I will say that the combat in this game feels incredible. There's somebody else in here. I just don't know where they are. Where's he at? Oh, there you are. Sorry, friends. Looks like it bounced away from you. All right, we're good there. Whoa, what is this? We got flying things here. I'm just going to... Keep my distance, because that's a lot of projectiles they're throwing. Those are eyes. Do I want to take out all these things? I would imagine. There we go. Gotta be careful here. It's a lot of guys, and they got the high ground. Beautiful. Okay, we've got some hieroglyphics here. Nice. Barred from the Citadel, Fright, Unforgivable Tattoo, the call digging into our minds. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Okay. Let me see... What is this? We've got something up there. I don't think we want these eyes to see us. Holy shiz. No, you don't. Okay. What is this? It's gonna take those guys out. What is this here? Translocator Xenotech device for long distance train. So we're gonna need an, an anathema key to be able to get in this door up here. <sighs> okay, don't don't fall off the map, Trev, please. I'm pretty sure if you die in this game, you go back to like square one I I'm pretty sure you respawn back at your, your spaceship so I'm gonna go back this way we, we clean this this area out a bit I do see that we've got a uh, an objective off over yonder so we need that key to be able to get in through that door I believe is gonna be our plan here but for now we're gonna want to go this way Ooh. new thing for us to be able to Take a look at Xenotype new consumable. device acquired. I think this will prove a useful tool. Okay. Takes us up to adrenaline level five. We'll we'll take it. All right, another fast travel point. And we are now locked in here, fellas. Okay. We're gonna start by hitting him from a distance, I think. Oh. 
All right, he's down. Let's go ahead and try to jump around, move around, let our, our extra damage thing recharge a bit. Who is this guy? Oh, shoot. I mean, if they're at a distance, I'm not going to close the gap for no reason. Okay. He's done. We've already got a better carbine. We're not going to use that. Our lockdown has been lifted. Which direction do we want to go? Our objective is back over that way. So we're going to want to go over here. Bro, how do we reheal? That's what I want to know. There appears to be another teleportation device, but more complex in construction. Not going to be able to collect those. Discovered a broken automaton. Clutching potential tool. Is this going to let us tap into those? Appears safe to repurpose. Oh. It's a sword. A xenotype blade weapon. Got a melee weapon Adding now? To equipment for immediate use. Okay. Press X to perform a melee attack. Ah, there you go. Okay, so we are going to be able to break these. You can attack hostiles, break stuff. Okay. Nice. I guess that's pretty useful. That's a crimson gate where it requires a crimson key. Mm. Can my blade... Ah, it can break... It can break red. Okay. Interesting. All right, I think that's... um. Did I... I, I've got some research to do. This game is, is so intense. There's so much going on. There's so much we need to find out. I honestly don't even know how to refill our health. I think we can potentially make health kits somehow with some of the resources we've been collecting, but um, we just need to kind of, you know, figure the, the baseline out. I, I feel like we were thrown off the deep end here and just told to swim. So, uh, I mean, it's it's been good so far. The, the gameplay feels really good. The mechanics, the, uh, you know controls the movement the gunplay the dodging incoming projectiles and stuff all that feels really good story-wise uh, we aren't too deep yet and I'm, I'm honestly still very very confused um you know I, it, it's interesting it, it's definitely interesting uh, i'd be curious to see what you guys are going to think about it so please leave comments down below and so if you guys want more be sure to let me know oh there's some sylphium all right Silphium is how we heal ourselves, but I'm pretty sure we can... I, I don't know, dude. I, I gotta figure it out. This game is crazy, and you gotta keep in mind, if we die, we start over back at the beginning with none of our perks, none of our upgrades, none of our weapons, none of our consumables, nothing. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys want more. Peace out.